knew we'd be, we'd be in the process, but I thought, you know, with the, the group of guys we had, we had a chance to win game. And the sad thing is we never really got on a, a winning streak type. You know, we, we'd be right there with certain teams, and we took good teams to the white, and that shows that if we just play hard and play together, we have a chance to be in every game. And I feel like if we would approach every game like that, we probably could be a playoff team. I know, it's tough to look at. You know, for a lot of people, it's tough to coach. You know, it's, it, growing pains are extremely difficult. And uh, we knew there'd be nights like this. You just hoped that there, there wouldn't be as many nights. You know, the good thing is we get to go tomorrow and play Chicago in Chicago. He's playing really good. So that's the, <laughs> <laughs> so that's the positive thing. What I like is I think our rookies have been more physical and competitive than some of the guys we've had back. That's disappointing at times, you know, because you wouldn't expect that, you know, if anything, your, your, your rookies would be guys that would be kind of taken back playing against guys that wouldn't be as aggressive. That hasn't been the case. So, um, you know, I mean, you know, that's the positive, I guess. Yeah, no matter that we know it's uh, people are hurting and it's a rebuilding process, you still shouldn't uh, not have no heart, not fight, not compete, and not be into game, you know. I said there's an opportunity for people to step up, so uh, we're not looking in and looking for no excuses. It's just us not playing hard and not competing. The teams are coming here and uh, putting on the show, and our crowd is uh, cheering for them.